the world is moving towards a greener and healthier environment and Caddy can assist you in accomplishing this in your designs. In front of me I've got a model, AEC model with once again walls, windows, doors, roof etc. To utilize this in doing energy efficiency calculations I'm going to go to the schedule commands under architecture first option that you've got is energy efficiency setup once you click on that it will load you a dialog box in which you can specify first of all your north angle orientation you can pick it from your drawing or specify it in the dialog box the location by choosing a town the nearest town or city it will automatically place you into a specific climate zone the ticks for your window calculations the colors and thickness for your facades and then you can specify how many stories this building contains now the current one I've got in front of me only has one so you give that story a name you give it a description and when you click on OK that completes your energy efficiency setup if I want to do energy efficiency window and door specifications you click on the relative command relevant command it will highlight all the windows that I've done already for instance if I want to click on that one the arrow will point towards the outside it will pick up the width the height and the area from the window that you specify it also gives you the outer face of window to the extent of shading or in other words the P and the G value which you can see on your drawing on the right hand side over here the P value is basically the window face to the extent of your shading and the G value is the top of your windows vertically to the underside of your shading extent the orientation it picks up from the arrow you can mirror that changing the direction if the window is drawn in the wrong direction you specify the story in this case I only have one story and then you also choose the performance for that window in other words the kind of material used because that will affect your U value and your SHGC value you can also specify user-defined values if you do get information from the manufacturer. Once you click on OK, make sure by looking at the ticks that you've done all your windows. Then also you have to do some energy efficiency by specifying the facades. If I click on facades, it asks you for the height of your facade and what story it is located at say OK and specify I want a facade from there to there and once again you can specify the direction for the outside of the facade you must also calculate areas or create areas in your model currently I've done three areas already so I'm just going to do a fourth one to specify or show you how it works I snap to the corners of that room once I say option end it will ask me what do I want to call that area so let's call it area 4 it's located on the ground floor you can make the text visible the text plottable the polyline plottable and your area height as well and it will add a polyline in there creating areas so those areas will be used in the calculations for energy efficiency once you've done the areas the facades the windows and doors etc we are ready to do a calculation it will give you a confirmation of how many stories there are how many windows and doors facades and areas and say do you want to continue with the calculations if I say yes it will either do it in the command line or create a text file so let us just create a text file from that and then you can give it a name so let's just put it on my desktop get 17 and just overwrite the existing one called fenestration let's overwrite that file 
once it's gone through all the calculations, it will open up the text file for you in Notepad and it will give you a summary and all the calculations associated with that design. It will give you the window to floor area ratio is 17.96 degrees. If you go down a bit, it does the conductance. So the total conductance for the story is 101.3. Solar heat gain it starts with the calculations and at the bottom will give you total solar heat gain for the story as 6.58 and then it works out your artificial ventilation as well going through all the math and say the story is suitable for aircon and or mechanical ventilation and that is how caddy helps you in making your design a greener and more efficient design